All right, so as you guys all know, my city is 100% custom. I primarily focus just on building my own modulars, my own mocks, because that's what I enjoy doing, and it, it, it's just kind of most fun for me. Um, however, I do own a number of official sets, and in my LEGO room, I actually have a second table. So in today's video, we are gonna start the first phase of this second city. It's gonna be all official sets, all the modulars, uh, you name it, that's what's gonna go in here. No mocks, nothing like that. So let's get started. So the first thing I'm gonna do is start laying down the outline of the train track. As you can see, all my tracks are ballasted on base plates. My goal is eventually to convert all my you know, existing official modulars to a mill system. Um, I do think that the ballasted train tracks just look a lot nicer, a lot cleaner. They are pretty part intensive and kind of reconstructing it all was a little bit of a pain here, but uh, in the end, I think it's, it's worth the effort for sure. All right, so now that we've got the initial outline of the train loop, uh, by no means is this the final product. I'm sure it'll change over time, but I wanted to just get something on the table so I can just start placing buildings and kind of get a sense for how I want to position things. Uh, so now is my favorite part of the, the project is actually placing the modulars in and switching them around, seeing which ones I like you know, to go next to each other. Uh, so this is the fun part. All right, so let's talk about a couple things now that we have the initial layout kind of built. So you can see that, again, none of these are on a mills plate except for the Grand Emporium, and that's only half built purely because I haven't had the time to go back and finish it. Um, again, lots of little details to fix. I got to finish the brown tiles on the train. I got to fix that one little gap you can see there. Add landscaping, add minifigures. There's a lot left to do but at least this gives me a pretty good idea of where things are headed. So obviously still lots of gaps to fill, lots of t you know visible table, um, but again, I like where it's headed. I did lie, there is one uh, mock in there that I, I don't place in my other town because it just doesn't fit, so I had to shove it somewhere. Uh, you do see some roads, which again, my other city has no roads, but I do have some of the official sets that are, you know, the vehicles, the speed champions, stuff like that. So I wanted to make sure I had a, at least a place to put them. Uh, I tried to group the buildings kind of based on how I thought it would look nice. I've got some ideas for some landscaping, some parks, some trees uh, throughout the city just to activate it and give it a little more detail. So we'll get to that in a future video.
All right, so focusing in on the left side of the table, you can see here it's just the Ninjago sets and the Ghostbusters Firehouse and sort of my mo modified medieval blacksmith. Again, not the final placement. I just needed a place to put these sets. Um, one thing about the blacksmith is I'll be doing a video, kind of an ongoing series, because uh, I plan on building around it and building a little bit more of a scene. So uh, be on the lookout for that. But overall, this side of the table, again, is just kind of filler for now. Uh, eventually, we'll do something a little more special with it. All right, so just kind of panning through the city, you know, I'm happy with it. Again, this was just a morning's worth of work. So we've still got more roads to add, you know, more buildings to add, details to flush out. But, you know, overall, I'm happy with it. I think it flows nicely and it's nice to see some of these buildings back and out. Uh, you know, some of these sets are, are some of my favorites, to be honest, the town hall being one of them. Uh, so, yeah, I like it. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed today's video. Again, I'll be updating this, so be on the lookout for future videos. You'll see some, some new growth, some new buildings, some new development in the city, so uh, I'm excited about it.